What's good? D Dexter is here with Bedtime produced by himself and Jacko. Artwork is cool. I just don't like the two lines and the font he used for D Dexter. Otherwise, the Bedtime font is and how he's like slouched waiting on whoever he's saying Bedtime to. That's cool. The lighting is cool too. Let's listen to the song. Okay, okay. I soften Spend time, you know we all me. Do it all me. Do it all time. You know I love it when we fall play. Girl, that you never Clarity, clarity. I just wanna hold on to body to body, girl. Uh, like it when you slow and for me, slow and for me, girl. Slowly, funny to bring it back on me. Oh, please, girl, you got me tripping. There's a vibe, there's a vibe. Okay. Are we done? Oh, we really done. <laughs> okay, let's uh speak on it. D Dexter, bedtime produced by Jacko and D Dexter. Like I said, artwork is okay. The song itself is okay. Let's speak on the lyrics and the clarity with which he delivers these lyrics. The first words, I'm craving your what? Had a hard time getting that. Granted, I was still speaking, but I didn't get that. There wasn't clarity. And the worst thing is the vocals were like buried in the beat. The beat was kind of louder than the vocals. You were hitting them high notes. I was supposed to like feel them, Momo, but you were like, like as though I'm speaking like this. Like the beat is overwhelming your vocals, yet your vocals are... You know, I can feel that you were hitting them high notes. Your voice is smooth. Granted, you can sing. But I had some clarity issues there. Verse 2. There was no verse 2. <laughs> I don't know. I'm treating the first words as verse 1. When you got into it, when you began the verse, I, I, I could hear, I could get a sense of what you were saying. Bedtime. Bedtime. There was a vibe to that hook. It's something catchy. So the writing has potential. But work on your clarity and make sure everything you say isn't, one, hindered by slang, two, hindered by how you mix these tracks. Make sure your vocal is crisp to the A, even when a crisp brown, regardless of how charming they want to come out on a beat, they make sure the listeners get what they are saying. And the listeners are mainly girls, so how are you going to chuff a girl or charm a girl into liking you or getting to that bedtime situation with you when she doesn't know what you're saying, man. <laughs> oh, she, she can't understand, especially the first part. You know, second part after that line, Pathist, when you, right before the hook, yeah, I, I, I could get what you were saying. Yeah, so there's just two issues really here, clarity and mixing. Beat is dope. I like that both of you produced this. It had that kick, it had that R&B vibe to it, but it needed to be vocals on top of things so that I get exactly what you're communicating. 
to this person you are saying bedtime to. Otherwise, vibes, vibes, gentlemen. There's potential here. Let me know what you think of Bedtime by D Dexter, produced by Jacko and D Dexter. The new wave are in the place. <laughs>